by software, you mean the design software? Yes. Uh, in French, it's CAO, or in English, it's EDA, um, Electronic Design Automation. That's all the tools we need to have to design the chip. If you have a writer, you just need to have Microsoft Office that you will spend it 10, 10 euros a month to have it. In our cases, we have a huge pool of software we have licensed with plenty of different products to help us during the different phase of the, the design, to, to design, to test, to emulate. Uh, so it's, it's very expensive and we have guys which are experts in all these tools because today you don't design a chip and especially a CPU without a fully, let's say a full, um, full batch of, uh, of design software. Plus the data centers we have built, where we push push the design, we simulate the design to. A twenty show it. Up. For example, I know that uh, simulated the design is uh, a complex task that you don't do in traditional hardware. They... So you can simulate by software. After, if you want to simulate at so-called gate level, it's huge in terms of compute time. Uh, we have one of the largest machines in Europe called, and it's an emulator. It's a rack of FPGAs where we can drop into this rack of PGAs uh, or FFPGAs an image of the chip and this chip will work at something like let's say 500 kilohertz instead of 3 gigahertz but at 500 kilohertz you can start you can start the software so the Linux kernel will boot in a couple hours and just three start, hours in our cases and starting to simulate